everyone, my name is Tyler Oakley and this is my video <laughs> for today. Mm. Tyler, where'd you get that sweater? It's so cute. So I'm assuming you're asking about the sweater that I wore in my last video. Um, it's from American Apparel. If you didn't know, American Apparel's going out of business. So I went there and the sales are crazy. So I went and I got every color <laughs> because that's what I do. I don't know what happens in my brain, but when I like something, I'm like, oh, I need 40 of those. I have a black t-shirt from American Apparel. It's just called, I think like the boxer tee or something like that, or the hammer tee, the hammer tee. And uh, it's black and it's plain and it fits and I liked it so much I went back and I bought like 40 more. I, I don't know, I can't help it. I just, part of me is thinking, okay, well Steve Jobs is all like, oh, you have to simplify your life, like eliminate all these like options in your life. Like every time you have to make a decision, it's taking away from the productivity of your life. So I'm like, oh, he always wore the same outfit every day to like get rid of that. So does what's his head, that one guy who made Facebook, Mark Zuckerberg. So I'm like, maybe I'll be productive if I don't have to figure out what t-shirt to wear. So I bought just one t-shirt and I always just wear the black t-shirt. Of course, the one day I'm not wearing the black t-shirt I talk about this black t-shirt but it's a really good t-shirt and I bought like 40 of them and I love my t-shirt it's a good t-shirt what can I say back to your question where did I get the sweater American Apparel Devin says Tyler do you have a mole on your wrist apparently all gays have moles on their wrists I don't have a mole on my wrist you probably saw this is what you're referring to it's an acorn tattoo um, but I love that you are like jump into that conclusion and you are all caps all about it have you actually read any youtuber books uh, yes I have like every single youtuber book I haven't read all of them yet I'm getting through them I am just about to start Josh Sunquist's new book called love and first sight he is another youtuber that I absolutely adore so if you want to listen to it with me you can use audible.com slash Tyler Oakley and get your first 30 days for free Free if you just use that link. Audible.com is the leading provider of audiobooks, original audio shows, comedy, and news, so you can get anything you could possibly want. They're perfect for driving or when you're at the gym. Again, go to audible.com slash Tyler Oakley if you want to get a free 30-day trial. Thank you so much to audible.com for sponsoring this video. I have loved you for years now, and I love having our little book club. So if you want to join, again, audible.com slash Tyler Oakley. What is your favorite thing about moving to a new place? Having a dishwasher? I used to just like pile my dishes in the kitchen for like a week, two weeks, and then it would get grotesque, and then I would be like, I hate my life. It would get to the point where I would get, this is gonna be so grody, tin foil and put it over a bowl and have my cereal like that, because I saw it on like Tumblr or something, and I would rather do that than have to clean my bowl. <sighs> Times were tough. And, and like, I just wouldn't use utensils anymore. I'd literally just be like, mmm, delicious. I love all this, like, blah, blah, blah. But now, I'm like, yeah, give me a fork. Who cares? I'll wash it. There are things in my new home that I just... There's no other way to put it. I love it. Jess wants to know what is my one gay regret? What is my one gay regret? I think I was bad at being inclusive to the rest of the gay community when I was younger. I think that's really shitty of me. And not just the other letters in LGBTQ+, but like also other people within the gay community, like people of color or gays with disabilities, things like that. I feel like I regret not stepping my bitch ass up when it came to being better for my brothers and sisters and siblings within the LGBTQ plus community. Gamlin says, would you ever do an apartment tour? I don't know, would you guys wanna see my new home? Maybe I will. Give this video a thumbs up if you want that. Maybe I would do it. Alexis says, do you ever wanna go on tour again? Absolutely, I have plans for things that I wanna do in the near future. But in the meantime, I am actually going to a couple events that I'm so excited to meet you guys at. VidCon in America and VidCon in Europe. So if you wanna go to those, the details on those are below. Faith says, can you reenact a scene from La La Land? Beep, 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 beep. Jasmine says, will you ever get a career in politics or run for president? I don't know. I don't know. So the last time I was at the White House, I got to meet a guy named Cal Penn. This is him. He is somebody that went from entertainment to politics and obviously could just do acting and be good to go. But he decided to join the Obama administration and work at the White House and do public service. And it showed me that, you know what? If I wanna do that, I can, and maybe, who knows, maybe someday I will. I don't know. And finally, it's Tyler, will you come to Idaho because we are just a bunch of potatoes and we need your happiness? Listen, I will go where I'm needed, okay? I will go where I will have the most impact, but I gotta say, you are really sweet talking to me with that potato talk because I love a sweet potato, a baked potato, a curly fry, a waffle fry, even smiley fries. You know, the frozen ones that they give you in middle school that are like disgusting? Even those types of potatoes I'll live with. Mashed potatoes, yum, delicious. 
I just love potatoes. So yes, I'm on my way. So I think that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see my latest video, click right there. If you want to hear my latest podcast, click right there. Again, you can watch the podcast on full screen if you get the app. But yes, that is all I have for you guys today. I will see you guys very soon. Mwah.